Hello everyone and welcome. This is Ryan923456 and today we are going to be starting our adventure with Europe 1200, a mod for Mountain Blade Warband. So let's see. We are going to start a new game. Now for those of you who don't know, Mountain Blade Warband is a first person or third person medieval RPG game. And it's one of my favorite games. I love it. I mostly play in first person, but you can switch between the two so you can fight in whichever style you prefer. And this mod was developed by some great folks. You, know, you can find them under the Europe 1200 tab in the Tail World forms. But enough of that. Let's see. All right. Well, let's go with Mail. Let's see. Your father was, let's say he was a veteran warrior. And let's say he got killed in combat, as messed up as that is. So he got raised to street orchard. <laughs> or <laughs> or I don't know where I got that. But as an adult, let's say I became a smith. I got forced out of my home. And now I'm going to ride to my destiny. My name's going to be Thomas. Thomas is a good name. Alright, so I'm going to up the charisma so I can get leadership. And I'm up the agility, so my riding will improve, as well as my athletics. I'm going to improve my iron flesh and power strike for battles. And we're going to finish with shield. I'm put up, throwing up to 50, pull arms 50. One-handed weapons will improve naturally in combat, so we'll focus on archery. Alright, character creation. Beard. Okay. There we go. Now we got our Thomas. We're gonna go to. Uh, let's go to England. And here we are, just outside of London. We're gonna head to London town. Recruit some militants. Then we got one. Not a great start. So, some tools, pick up some grain. You always have to have food in your inventory, or else you're immune, you're middle star. And since we can't recruit anyone else here, might as well leave. Let's head to Norwich. Now, cool thing, if you want to move faster, you just hold down control in the space bar, and move like a... A lot faster. <laughs> All right. So we're gonna go ahead and Norwich. All right, we got nine. That's a lot better than what we had before. All right. So let's see. Hmm. You can recruit serfs and the like from towns, but. I want to refrain from that. Oh, we got some marauders. Let's take your money or your life. We're pretty evenly matched. So, let's see how we do. Oh, I missed. Oh, I got him. Oi. I forgot the Marauders had horsemen. <laughs> that may not go well for us. I do believe we are winning. is left. That looks like someone took off. Oh, there he is. Oh, we ain't gonna get him. Oh, we won! I'm 
just going to go into my character thing real quick. Upgrade. Let's get prisoner management and inventory management. Go up the archery to 40. Alright. So we won. And since we upped our prisoner management, we can capture prisoners now. So we got two marauders. And we're just going to go ahead and upgrade to spearmen. Now, there's lots of different ways you can go about gameplay. Um, some people like to go be mercenaries. Some like to serve a lord. You can do that in Europe 1200. Find their army. But I'm going to try and get my own fighting band together. So let us head to Nottingham to see what damage we can do. to join. That's weak. Alright, no one wants to join. Alright. And I do believe the thing I forgot to do was get the inventory of those marauders. So I'm going to pay for that mistake. Oh, we got some bandits I'd here. slit your throat for a trinket. So I think we can take them on. Yeah, number by one. Alright, let's see. Come on, man. Can you go fast enough? down the control button you can just click everything and it will automatically go into the other inventory if you click over here it'll just come over here click there it'll go over here so very very time effective now as far as armor goes we got a helmet I think we're okay we're not fighting anything really heavy we're just fighting bandits I do need a thicker shield that is one thing I do need. So I'm going to go ahead and grab this Huskar on shield. Yeah. Alright, 3200. This is a little bit better sword, but it's out of our price range. So. We're just going to stick to the things that we can afford. Let's see if we can get any more groups of near dwells to slaughter. Seven Welsh peasants. Marauders. 3.5, 3.4. We should not be able to catch them, but hopefully they'll attack us. Right. Hope they're running from us. We ain't gonna catch them. They have just a little bit more speed than we do, unfortunately. But I don't see any 
bandits. Oh, here we go. Some looters. Looters are the lowest of the oh, low. They have the, the worst, worst armor. armor. <laughs> They're the easiest to kill. Fighting looters. It's really a one-sided thing. Not really have much support. Face bar, jump over the water. Alright, yeah, see this for rocks. This for water's like darts. Too slow to catch anyone. So I think this is a good limit. So we'll just stick with what we got and control the English countryside. And we just pass it through. I'm not gonna go out of them. Now, bandits. Are... My men would like a word with you about your personal belongings. We can take bandits on. Brigands are the hardest. Those guys are the worst. Alright, and since they have an uphill advantage, I'm not going to be able to be as effective with this charge. But I'm still going pretty fast. Should be really, really equipped. So maybe we could even take on some brig brigands if we find them. Excuse me, my throat is a little dry. All right, let's have our Welsh spearman, our English militia. So we got a pretty good layout here. Pull up the intelligence and the charisma. And with that, we'll increase our pathfinding by two, and athletics by one. Athletics is how fast you can run in battle, and pathfinding is how fast you move on the campaign map. So even with 21 men, we will move significantly faster than we would have otherwise, which is good because we need the speed. So let's see what we can find. 
Marauders. Marauders. Last time we couldn't catch up to them, but this time we're going more than more enough. Than we enough. have more than enough speed, so we catch them in whales. <laughs> Look at this guy, he's all innocent. What is it? Like acting all like he didn't do nothing wrong. Alright, wait. I don't know how that happened. Accidental clicking. We have 14 minutes 20, I believe. Let's see how it goes. sell the stuff from last time but what we can do is get rid of the bottom half and replace it with the top half of this because this stuff is worth more all right now we have to sell the stuff all right we need to close this town is chester so that is what we will do Militants. Eight Welsh peasants. Alright. I think we could even take on brigands if we found them at this point, but I don't think we're going to find them. Now, I'm trying to. Let's see. I'm more than likely going to follow the path of the mercenary. Become a mercenary. And in doing so, let me see. First, let me upgrade these guys. Welsh spearmen. Welsh peasants, spearmen. All right, and we have character attributes we can use. Let's do strength this time, and we'll devote it to power draw. After all, we're learning archery. Just upgrade some of the ones we have the worst proficiency in. And with that, we're on the move. What is my renown? Twenty-four. If we can get it up to thirty or higher, I believe we can become a mercenary. Mercenary band. band. Bandits. Perfect. All right, 29 against 20, let's do this. I don't have any cavalry yet, so it's just me. Oh no. I'm 
definitely gotta watch for horse's health in moments like this. Because you do not want to be caught without a horse in the middle of the enemy. That is an instant recipe for death. Access the item pool. Ooh, this is 25. Oh, this is more, more protection. Alright, more protection. I like it. Just gonna add all this up right here. And we should be good. 